two children are missing from a West Finger neighborhood. Police are asking all residents to keep an eye out and report anything unusual they might have noticed relevant to the case. We're dealing with an abduction, two kids gone missing. And this starts a journey that spans, I guess, like 40 years. When I started thinking of a way to tell a man's life story through the vehicle of a mystery, I almost immediately began to think about, well, where would this be? And then the story and the setting start to inform each other. There are places that we have to go that are deeply uncomfortable, unsettling. Walking up through these caves and being on the mountains and the cliffs, I think it made it distinctive to where we were and what our characters were experiencing. It spotlights up and down each one of these streets. Here, here, and here. In the wintertime, when we first get to Wayne and Roland and doing the investigation of the kids, we pretty much hazed in this entire neighborhood at night. There are cops looking with searchlights, and it just kind of gives this really eerie sense that I think signifies cause and the concern of the story. Houses are boarded up, people move away, industry leaves. This crime happens, and it shatters the community. Do you remember the place? I don't remember the evolution of Wayne Hayes' journey. And obviously, this crime affects this character in a very significant way. Wayne is just a phenomenal character, filled with a sense of purpose, going on the journey of the investigation, digging into the next clue, following the next lead, and finding suspects and questioning people. We went by your place, you sort of collect things, huh? I salvage trash that I can sell. You like kids, generally? Roland's pretty much the heavy, you know, when it comes time to do questioning, to do interrogations. This season, to me, has so much to do with life, memories, and just time. For Amelia, I think the case becomes a sort of surrogate child to take care of. As the teacher of the children, there's a really deep vested interest for that reason from the very beginning. As we all get deeper into the mystery, it becomes clear that this is going to be a story that will essentially take up a good chunk of all of our lives. It's a 30-year journey. It's a 30-year case. It goes a lot deeper than your typical mystery crime. You get an overview of Wayne Hayes's life and a sense of the bigger picture of the life of these people and the life of this community that's affected by this tragedy. It's that unfinished story of the missing child where those great fears is that your children disappear.